It was one of the biggest attractions at Elgin's Green Expo, May 4th and 5th at the center of Elgin. I guess you could say it had a steady stream of onlookers as we learn more. Hi, my name's Jim Vitero, and I'm the owner of the uh, big fish tank behind me. It's the actual name of it. It's called the Hog Trough. I'm from Worcester, Ohio. I get to travel around the country with this tank. Um, one of the biggest questions I get is uh, where the fish come from. The fish are local fish. These fish here that's in this tank came from the Fox River. They were shocked up from Plano, Illinois, and the Division of Wildlife brought them to us to display to, uh, here at the Green Expo uh, to let the public know um, what species and stuff are in, in the Fox River. There's actually an endangered species in here, which is the red horse uh, sucker. And we got about five or six of them, so a lot of people's been asking about that. The other question I get a lot about is this tank. I pull it down the road empty. It doesn't, it doesn't go down the road full. Uh, there's no baffles. I wouldn't be able to stop or anything like that. So, um, so I'm also going to be up on top of the tank doing lure demonstrations throughout the show and uh, talking about just basic spinner bait, crank baits and some small little jigs and stuff like that. Yeah, the official go uh, Divisional Wildlife will be here at the end of the show. We'll load them back up and we'll run them back down to the Plano area uh, because there's like one species he told me that's not up this far in the river because of the dam system. They can't swim as far up. So we had to release them back down where they came from. I intermingle with the kids and stuff like that, but what I do is I teach people the different baits and how to work them the correct way and how fish respond to the baits and stuff like that. These fish here probably won't respond very well. Uh, they're pretty stressed out uh, with uh, transportating from the fox and being electroshocked. It's electroshocking is how the Divisional Wildlife um, does their studies on the different species and stuff and fish populations in a river or a lake or a pond system. It stuns them for basically about five to ten seconds and they float to the surface. The Divisional Wildlife um, nets what they want and then they'll make, if they're doing studies they'll measure them and like the one fit, big flathead catfish in here has got a red tag in red tag on it and it was electroshock last year part of the the flathead catfish study that they're doing here in the Fox River. How'd you get the, the call to come here to Elgin to do this show? A guy named Gary Swick uh, he is involved with the Northern Illinois hunting and fishing days. We, I also play that show down here in September which is down in Yorkville and that's how he referred my name here to Siggy it's the uh, promoter for this and they contacted me and that's how it all kind of went about.